What's up, everyone? The games are here for part 15 of the uh, Crash Bandicoot 4 playthrough. So, we got finished with, with the Snow World, right? We beat out the Cortex for the fourth time, and apparently he turned good! But can we trust him, though? <laughs> no, well, Cortex, probably not. <laughs> but, in this episode, we're gonna do some more inverted stuff. Oh yeah, you was BRB for this level when we first visited here. Yeah, this, oh, okay. yeah, this is level where you play as uh, Tom for the first time, and you had to save uh, Crash and Coco when they got captured by the, uh, by the pirates. Ah, uh, yep. let's see. Missed spot. <laughs> oh yeah, play more Splatoon shit. Yep, it's also like you missed the spot. Yeah, as I mentioned, I like how it's all, like how it's all black and white like in Thomas Wolf and Kingdom Hearts 2. Hmm. Yep, and I'm still psyched by that about that trailer, Kingdom Hearts 4. Well, I'm sure you everyone else is. Yep. Oh, I played some more Kirby today. I'm still in the uh, final world. Uh, I might play more of that tomorrow. Yep. Oh yeah, Easter is coming this Sunday. Yeah. Not gonna do much on that day. Oh, I'll be working. It'll be fine. Yeah. Hopefully not too busy. I wouldn't be surprised if it was, honestly. Alright. But, never know. Just be glad now we're going on Black Friday. Oh uh, yeah, but well, yeah, Black Friday be a lot worse, honestly. Yes. That, that, that can't argue with right there. Yeah, that's why I don't, I don't, that's why I don't go to the store, I don't go to the mall during Black Friday. I might go to the corner store, but that's different. Yeah, the only thing with that is I have to well, most of us have to start an hour early. Early than we normally do it for Black Friday. <laughs> fucking hell, it's nuts. I see. You know, we usually check sticks and they open up the five instead. Hmm. But we get to get out an hour early to make it up for it, so. Eh. All's fair. Yeah. Oh, and two more days till Mario Golf comes out on the Switch Online. Hmm. What is that? Yeah, probably gonna main Peach as well. I would say what was Lena, but she doesn't appear to Mario Galaxy. Yeah. She's been overused ever since. Oh, this 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 hidden gem blend in the background. You can easily miss that because it's all blend to the freaking white shit on the wall. Yeah, I think I I think I caught that by accident. Gonna, uh, just gonna all the characters in uh, Mario Golf. I know Mario is in it, no shit. Bowser is in it. Wario, I think. Yep. Donkey Kong. Yep. Kamak, I think. I don't know. I know, uh, Metal Mario is in there. <laughs> Yep, Metal Mario. I love how he, he appears in, Smash, in Super Smash Bros. The original, but you don't play as him. Nope, just an enemy to fight. Yeah, he's part of the uh, final boss in a way. Yeah. Then you fight those damn those Pentagon clones, Polygon. I did. I did this record. Then you fight the Master Hand. Well. Huh. Hey, oh yeah, oh, you know, they, they should put that to the, uh, put that on Switch Online. The original, that would be cool. Yeah, yeah, the original Smash Bros, where, where it all started at all. Well, it all started by Mario tripping, uh, Yoshi. <laughs> and he never apologized, he never apologized to Yoshi after that. In Smash Ultimate trailer, when, when, um, when Sora got revealed, actually. He shook Sora's hand, but he never apologized to Yoshi for kicking him. <laughs> oh my. Or 
Revenge. She goes, she goes revenge. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you can somewhat. <laughs> Y'all. Yeah. Yeah, that, awesome. yeah, that thing, that thing killed me because when, when that thing uh killed you, right, he'll he'll trap in that barrel and put like spikes on it. <laughs> but yeah, I remember playing the original Smash Bros. on NCD4 way back. I I I I used to enjoy the uh the Star Fox level. Smash? Yeah, they were the one. Oh yeah, those, that was good, yes. It's the one with the freaking uh, army attacks you at random. <laughs> Peach's castle was was alright. Oh I oh I like the Mushroom Kingdom one which is unlockable. Yeah. That was one of my favorite uh, levels to fight in. I love how you how you go in that war pipe, right? And sometimes uh, it'll take you to a bombless pit, but you have to jump before you land in it. Yeah, I think you're gonna like that by uh, playing uh, target practice. Eyes on target. Oh, okay. Nice, nice. Oh, Crash and Coke got themselves kidnapped again. What do they do this time? Oh my god! The rope. <laughs> yeah, what the what the fuck was that? She cut the rope, but the rope didn't get cut. No. Jet board jetty or jet set radio inverted. <laughs> you know what's funny? What if yo when if I when I when I as a video pad. It is possible for me to uh, to mirror this video to make it seem like I'm playing this level normally, but then where's the fun of that when it comes to inverted levels? Because <laughs> the only thing, the only, the only thing, the only thing different is that y you won't see the uh, numbers in um in mirrored. And that's about it. That's true. So yeah, so welcome to what uh, Jetboard should eat inverted. Yeah, this level is pretty fun, also. Normal or inverted. Excuse me. Yeah, it's the one with the mini bosses, the, the squid boss. And yeah, and yeah, and yeah. You don't even you don't even fight the squid boss during the time trial um, missions, that, which is good. Cause, like Cause squid little man, just imagine going for the platinum relic, and you gotta take down that mini boss really, really fast. Because the main boss kind of drags on because because you gotta let that freaking um those 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 rats hit the tentacles. Hmm. I don't know why, but for some weird reason, I kind of hear the duck hunt theme a little bit doing the soundtrack. Oh my god, come on, man. Don't you hate when that happens? You try to break a box and you slide past it like you collect those damn notes in Banjo Kazooie? Yes. Ah, the Not So Cortex is bonus uh, room. Due to the level design. Yeah, like I mentioned, if I, if I mirror this video, the level would look normally, but the, but the word bonus would be backwards. Or mirrored, I mean. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. See, it wasn't that easy in Crash One because they, they had no, they had no double jump or the drop shadow. That's true. <laughs> so low how when you jump on the box, right? All that freaking uh paint like jumps out of the box. Alright, now we gotta round, round the boat and dodge the freaking, um, those, those damn, uh, pole spikes. Huh. 
I need to play more Smash. Yeah. Oh yeah, I, I did play a little bit of uh, Melee a long time ago. Uh, <laughs> hey, y'all. You know, yeah, it was. Yeah. Oh, heard that growl, the freaking squid. But yeah, I, I mean, I, I did play some of Melee, like, way back. Tackley, uh -huh. Bowser's, and Peach's first appearance. And Zelda and Sheik. Mewtwo. Yep. Oh my so god. Yeah, I like a Mewtwo on Melee was a bit because you had, to, you had to leave the freaking game on overnight. Just on lock over. Yeah. So they were hard to get, but uh, it was still worth it, yeah. Yeah. But the reason why you had to do that because, um, because technically by leaving your game on, um, uh, as I say, a lock and mute too is based on your on your game hours. All right, right. Yeah, and and you and, and you had to sit, and you had to let the game sit for sit all night. Well, I just get playing it a lot throughout my days, just to mm. so it came out to tell me that oh, it's a lot now. <laughs> yeah. Because you have a chance to fight it now, so sure, okay, let's do it. Yeah, I know the final boss was Giga Bowser in that one. I did not like that fight. Yeah, I can't remember if Master Hand was on there. No, Stig and Bowser, Ganondorf, Oh, and... yeah, Ganondorf first appearance. Oh, Mewtwo. Yeah. Yeah, it was all three of them getting a fight. That, that fight was so hard. <laughs> yeah, they bring back an ultimate. Just for old time's sake. At least it can still be handled there. Alright, now we're taking on the green, uh, the green gym path. Yeah, I enjoy also more than Smash 4, to be honest. Cause Smash, let's just say a Smash 4 on the Wii U, it, it really wasn't all that great. Yeah, because some of the, most of the characters wasn't on there, like, they, they took Snake, they took, uh, Snake off for some reason. I never really got to try the Wii U version of it, so I really can't answer that one. Yeah, you didn't really miss much. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say that right now. I think it was that one and the 3DS one. I never got a chance to play up. Uh, yeah, I heard that wasn't. I heard that wasn't worth it either. <laughs> hmm. But I never played this, the 3DS version. Oh yeah, that's the one that came out before the Wii U version, which is odd. Yeah, I can't say that. I, I really can't say those time exclusive shit. Hell. Hey, you want to play a new Smash game? Get the 3DS. No, I, I, no thanks. I wait for the Wii U version to come out. It's like I thought you should have got the 3DS version. <laughs> yeah, that's the only. That, that's the only Smash game that appeared on the Hey Hell game. Yeah, it was the only one. Yeah. Don't know what the big deal is, but but odd. Mm. And yeah, and speaking of Smash 4, yeah, Smash 4 is the, is the only Smash game that doesn't have a well, aside from the original Smash and Me Melee, doesn't have story mode due to stupid reasons. So I think about um, when they did a uh, Subspace Emissary, they was they 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 upload on YouTube or some shit like that. I don't know. Okay. Yeah. But I was kind of bummed out that it took story mode off of Smash 4. But at least they brought it back in Smash Ultimate and we're all like... Now, now don't get me wrong, it was fun and all! I like it, but I prefer Suspect's Emissary from Brawl. Uh, yeah, that and the uh, Worldwide were both, were both pretty fun, really. Yeah, I know uh, freaking uh, Suspect's Emissary has some ups and downs because it was a platforming, which I didn't mind. And hit a gym, by the way. Do I look? I could sure they gave you in front of them too. And I could, and be honest with you, folks, I believe that was a cut. The hop, and be, 
and be honest with you folks, I, I did love the final gaunt, not, not the gaunt, but the final dungeon of, of um, Solid Space Emissary, the Great Maze. Oh, yeah, a lot of people say it was, it was annoying as hell back in the day, but I thought it was right. too. But after replaying it, it's not that bad as I thought. I ain't looting if I need a guide for, for that one. Yeah, I ain't knew it was a guide before that game. Yeah, I was trying to do it without it. The first time, and I literally got lost halfway through, and I was like, okay, I need a guide for this. Yeah, I got lost too, trying to find all the damn uh, trying to find all the characters and shit when they get captured. That's what I was trying to do. Yeah. I kind of I was holding on in circles. And yeah, when I got the when I got the guy before uh, Smash Ultimate, it was pointless because, well, it doesn't cover the um, it doesn't cover rural light. It, it it just show you the character's biograph and shit. That's about it. RPGs, movies. <laughs> yeah, we finally yes. we yep. forget. Yeah, I was wrong with that thing because I just want to that CS. So yeah, you want to get the guy before Smash Ultimate? Uh, it's I not know. worth it. Uh, I, did, kind of I think my Gato uh kind of screwed up. Okay. That was my second guess, but which one surprised me? Yeah, it does that something like like sometimes it, it like skips, like briefly. I don't know what caused it, and don't feel like be around the bush to fix it. Oh yeah, and we gotta, and we gotta beat this level again so I can go for the uh, lesson three gym, cause I died like six times in that level. Now let's let's go back to Japan. Give it a spin. See so, yeah, it more spin me right around like a record, baby. Oh yeah, you beat World Light yet, Raza? Yeah, I beat a while back. Okay. I got yeah, the final balls of yeah, the final balls Galeem and Donkey Han, they were fun as hell. Yeah, it was a pretty good it was a pretty good boss. Actually. And the music too was 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 outstanding. <laughs> oh you, you get the bad ending, right? Oh! Yeah, oh. Yep, my god all fucked up again. Damn. First time noticing that too. Huh. <laughs> um. Uh, yeah, I think it, I think it did the internet. The only thing I'm, I just missed a few spirits is the really rare ones. Oh, anyway, let me ask you again. You, you, you get the bad thing, right? Yeah. Okay, cause that's that's part of, that's part of your 100 requirements. Yeah, I did get that. Yeah, same here. I just think it, uh, I think I'm just missing like a few spirits from that. They're they're much more rare once you get. To yeah. You've been trying to get level that more or spirit board too, but I never got a chance to sort of pop up once. Yeah, cause the freaking bad. Wait, which bad do you think is worse? When you beat Gleam standalone or Dark Haunt standalone? Cause either way, everybody dies. Even Kirby. I would, you would think killing the Dark would be better. Yeah. To save the light, but no, it somehow gives you bad ending. Yup. Now, I think so, Gleam's that was was gruesome than Dark Haunt's. Cause that one got stabbed to death. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, and hit Jim by the way, look closely on the top right. <laughs> oh, right there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you, you can easily miss that because you're so focused on watching the damn uh, gate exploding. <laughs> yeah, but I'm probably still looking for Oh, yeah, and also, in one of the bad endings, uh, we see uh, Mario fall down on his knees and fates. Like he lost hope or something. Yeah. Yeah. 
I'm wondering if they're gonna sneak in another uh, DLC fighter. Just for the hell of it. No, I think mean, once it sort of from the last one, that's pretty much all. It's, it's all over. Yeah. If I were to choose, I would say put Ra Raven Beak in there. The final boss of Metroid Dread. I mean, yeah, Samus got Ridley. Yeah. yeah. They got those two in there, so. Yeah. I mean, third Metroid player with her. And now she got, and she got Dark Samus. <laughs> she might as well do a freaking Raven Beak. Okay, uh, four then. Yeah. And I'm still bummed up they didn't put Tifa on Smash Ultimate. And that me, all, and that me outfit on her looks ugly. Oh my, if you think that's ugly, look at the Shantae's me outfit. Uh, Ugh. Ugh, the horror. Oh, it's, it's not that bad. Yes, it is. <laughs> No, it's not. I cut, I cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> they make a female body out of it, the Shantae. There you go. <laughs> uh -uh. It may not be the same as Shantae, but it's still just as good. But, oh. <laughs> you look at Sonic's original design the first movie. Now that was god awful. Uh, okay, yeah, the first Sunday show, yes, it was. Yeah, I'm glad. I will admit to that. I will admit to that. that was not good. Yeah, I'm glad they After changed they it. Changed it. Yes, yeah, same here. Uh, it's it's it looks much better than change. I think. This. Yeah, it's supposed to come out in 2019, but it came out in 2020 because of the uh, change. Yeah, right before COVID happened. Yeah, and that was the last time with the movie there before the whole shit strike. Oh, and speaking yeah. of that bullshit, um, yeah, they're gonna make the uh mask a mandate now in my area, which is a crock of shit. Uh, ours got lifted about, uh, nearly two months ago. Well, they're gonna unlift it next week. On my, at my area. Oh, great. Yes. Well, they already it's not cooperating. They wear their freaking mask. Yeah, cause we, had, cause we had to deal with this shit for two years and we're getting sick of it. Well, everybody should know. Get your vaccine. Or just simply wear masks. Yeah. Yeah, I knew someone who had I knew someone who had a vaccine and they still got sick. Uh, oh yeah, I hell my mom got two vaccines and a booster. Yeah. She still somehow got uh, COVID. Yeah. Which was ridiculous. Like Like seriously, maybe I don't I don't fucking know. Let's just see this in me around like maybe. <laughs> uh, let's just see if this science is figured out. All I can say is I'm, I'm sick of this whole pandemic shit. That's all I can say. Well, everybody is. Everyone's tired of it. You're not alone with us. Yeah. You're tired of it. I'm sure PSL's tired of it. Yeah. And everyone else is. Okay, that's some name. Okay. Did you get a chance to read that person's name? They popped off, but alright. I don't even notice. You also use not noticing notifications when they pop on. Alright, so we pretty much got all the all the uh, grape gems. <laughs> uh there we go. Alright, so now we got, now we got to like, like, uh, jump, spin up, and break those boxes, right? Jump, lily pad, lily pad. Yeah, and those damn, um, those fly traps, not so fly trap lily pad can be nerve wracking. Especially if you're going for the purple relic. I was gonna be as fly traps, but yeah. Mm -hmm. Except for water. In the water, though, that works. Alright, so we got the box gym. So now we got all the gems in the third level, but we also got the uh perfect relic. Huh. It's been a while since we got one of those. But uh it seems to be uh crash, okay. Persona. Persona 5 strikers. More like Persona 5 crashers. Uh, no comment. <laughs> 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 like sky crashers. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he is fly trap. 
I forgot about that one. Perpetual chores. <laughs> Alright, let's go over to it. Oh, what the penis fly trap? Ain't that the freaking balls off of, um, off of that one video game? <laughs> no, I think this is a little bit joking off our pants with joke. Oh it's my god. I remember that, yeah. I've always seen it like twice before, but. Oh, fucking hell, that was hilarious. Oh yeah, speaking of, uh, Oh yeah, also, fun fact, uh, apparently, um, Sonic 2 is pretty much in first place. No surprise. Yeah, as I say, it's the most top watched since, uh, day one. Oh yeah, you saw the screen, you saw the picture of, uh, Sonic and Tails on there, right? Tails, look, he looks so pissed off in that picture. <laughs> like he wanted a goddamn spotlight. But yeah, it's gonna be on Paramount Plus next month, according to a source, and yeah, I'm most likely gonna watch again w when it's on Paramount Plus. Yeah, I know Sonic 1 movie is, is still on there, because I, yeah, I watched not too long ago before I see Sonic 2. Makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I hate getting those hiccups back in the day. I don't know if I mentioned this, but uh, there, there's a freaking myth legend where when you get a hiccup, you grow up. Oh. That's, that's, that's some shit that my sister used to tell me and my dad. I think it's a freaking myth. I've not heard of it before, but I didn't really believe it. Yeah. Dream King. Open cannon, ready fire. Oh, he's like, I love it. You can't even tell that freaking uh, gem is great. Well, now you can. When it's covered white. I did remember something silly back in my childhood, though. Uh, I'll see him when you know you age every year. Yeah. I can't think you can, if you get taller and after every year. No. I I kind of thought that too. <laughs> I was like, I don't want to get too big. We can fix a building or something. <laughs> that's, how, that's how it works. Yeah. Like, you sure? Like, I don't want to get too big. I knew I'm someone. Gonna... <laughs> I knew I'm someone who thought. Uh... Uh... I'm going to start sorry. Yeah, someone had a theory that if you die, if. Let's say if I die, since I'm a guy and all, I'll come back as a female. <laughs> Okay, that'd that be interesting. Or, could be worse, you could come back as a bug. Who the fuck wanna come back as a bug anyway? You, you gonna die any motherfucking way in two seconds. <laughs> well, I mean, coming back again, you can become something different, like, uh... Yeah. You know, like you said, like an animal, or a different person, just... You, uh, uh, just have, like, a different life that goes on, so... Yeah. <laughs> But, um, if I mean, if I were to come back, I wouldn't mind one of what it'd be like being a female, to be honest. <laughs> oh, yeah, cut that down, squid. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> yeah, we gotta fight this thing again. I said, if I wanna say it again, jeez Louise. <laughs> <laughs> what well, else? Oh, yeah, speaking of, uh, theories, I remember when I was young. Back when I used to enjoy Christmas, I always assume that it will snow every Christmas. Oh, maybe? Y'all. Yeah, because, think about it. Christmas, Christmas tree, snow, Santa Claus. Hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to hear. And that's the last time we're gonna see that, dude. Alright, so now we got all the gems in, uh, Jetboard Jetty, normal and inverted. Huh. Oh, oh, that's it, okay. Yeah, part's over. <laughs> and so, next time on Crash Bandicoot 4, we're going to the prehistoric land. So, until next time, later, folks.
Ooga booga. <laughs> Player. Later.